event is very meaningful for the media environment in East Africa because we actually try to address or even foster conversations in between generations, in between the young, the young journalists, the new generation which is on the rise, and the old, old guys in the business, you know, the legacy media, because I think media innovation or innovation in general can happen anywhere. It doesn't, I mean, we're here at this fantastic place at the MCI Media Hub. This is a perfect place for media innovation, but it can happen anywhere. It can happen in very rural communities. It can happen in your living room. It can happen in the newsroom with, the, with legacy media as well. So I think when we talk about media innovation, we talk about people, we talk about ideas, and we need co-creation and exchange because the knowledge is here. It's in Uganda, it is in the region, and that is why we need to have this conversation right here. Honestly, I thought that was one of the most interesting conversations we had yesterday, looking into the voices of the young people, addressing why they don't like engaging with legacy media. And I mean, this is a room full of media experts, of young journalists, and they say, I don't want, let me say it, they do not trust legacy media, they, but they never, officially they say they don't watch TV, they don't need the newspaper, so, of course, we can talk about why they don't read it, but seriously, here we also have the theme of conversation, really talking what are the needs and integrate it into legacy media, because I think we will not stop having legacy media in the near future, but really, we need to have that conversation because this is the environment. Also integrate young people into legacy media and also have the space for new formats available on the ground. I don't think it's a one or other way, we just need to get the voices together and have more conversation and understanding out there. Well, of course, we do have the Innovators in Residence. I mean, this is our flagship program and with the medias of Innovators, um, uh, the Innovators in Residence, sorry. Uh, we, of course, have a lot of innovators from the urban hotspots, from Kampala, from Dar es Salaam, Nairobi. And of what we try to do is to go the extra mile to rural communities because that is a strong belief we have as, as, the, as the Media Futures project. It doesn't have to be tech technology, tech uh, innovation. It doesn't have to be an app or shiny, glossy app. There's something you can show on a conference and say, please, this is my app, subscribe. But we, we truly believe that innovation has to be a benefit for the communities out there. So whatever is a benefit is worthy as innovation and it doesn't have to be technology it could be a new way of bringing people together having a different kind of conversation using the means you have on the ground especially in the radios differently for us that is media innovation and it's not always tech media innovation